welcome back to my channel uh, for those of you that don't know me my name is Aluk Makuch aka Aluk Fit Mom sorry I sound a bit off yeah your girl been sick but I'm not gonna let a little sickness keep me down hey nah but for real though like I've been dealing with this for like four five five days now but today I was just like nah man not 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 you are not taking any single day of mine again uh, anyway so before we get into this video guys don't forget to give this video a thumbs up uh please subscribe to my channel hit that notification button right there and yeah stay tuned um yeah i'm sure you guys know by the um title of this video that I am finally doing the J Sculpt fitness belt review. Uh, you guys have all been asking for this. I know it's been long overdue, but I'm finally doing it. We are here finally. Uh, so this is the belt. This is my old one. It's my old J Sculpt fitness belt. So this belt is supposed to to has no rolling whatsoever imagine that it covers the entire midsection that's a plus um, attach a belt with the velcro so that means like if you do lose inches and stuff you know you can always keep tightening it you know to get smaller get that waist snatched um, it says see there's no steel boning sit comfortably past the hip section which is a plus as well um, allow for custom clinching like, so before I got this belt a while back I think it's been like a few months now I made sure to watch like a lot of reviews on it you know I wanted to be sure like is this really worth it like is this is this gonna be worth my money you know so I've seen a lot of reviews and there were so many nice things about it but you know most of those reviews were sponsored so they kind of have to say all the nice things that they say about it or whatever but yes yeah, so when I first got this one the packaging was really off like it was in a little plastic bag thing and nothing else came with it it's just this in a little plastic bag posting thing so I was like oh okay because when I watch the other reviews and stuff they get this in like a nice beautiful box you know nice and pink it has like a little card with like some I think some manual type of thing in there but when I got mine it was different and I was just like okay maybe it's the website you know and then my, my bell said I think it said made in China this one says made in the US, the first one. So I have two belts. So this one is a size um, medium. I got this when I was a bit um, bigger and stuff. But I girl been working at, you know, and I lost a few inches. So I got um, the small, the small one, which I'm wearing right now. So anyways, um... Before I decided to get the small one, I was still using this one and it was alright until this happened. So there was like some hole or whatever, some hole poke through it. Can you see that? And this metal thing, whoa, this metal thing here used to always poke out and, um, and it was always like poking me right there during the workout and this kind of had had me sus I'm like okay then they said there's no no boning is that what they said no steel boning there's like a metal rod here yeah it's not it's off <laughs> but anyways yeah so that kind of that really um had me questioning, you know, so I'm like, okay, maybe I got this from the wrong website. I'm like, anyways, it's okay, now I'm a size smaller, I need to order a new one anyways. So I went through the Instagram page, 
got through got to the website through there and I ordered the second one and um, I'm like okay this time maybe I'll get it in the nice pretty box with the nice you know menu thingy with the, I don't know what was in there like meal plan or something you know so let's just wait for it and I was even tracking the um, shipping as well like the shipping for the first one I think took like two three weeks and it just came here and then the second one took about similar times as well and then when the second one came in it was the same packaging just a small little white plastic sleeve thingy and I was just like what the you know like y'all are here getting your your packages in a pretty box and we just here getting it in a little I'm like I know it's all good you know let's see let's try it on and then um, when we try it on fit perfectly like I really okay I'm not gonna I'm not gonna lie I like the belt like the belt is good you know it's snatched your waist it does all the things that it's supposed to do you know like it's a really good belt to wear like during a workout or under like your casual wear it's really good like I love this belt but also when you're wearing this like it's so comfortable you know you can breathe in there like for sure I can sleep in this like with this sweat belt I mean with this fitness belt I can actually sleep with it but I've never been really able to sleep with anything that's holding me like this but this is just so comfortable I could do anything in this I could literally wear it for all day all night because it's just that comfortable you know and the results are amazing like since I started wearing this I've lost a lot of inches on my waist like to go from a size medium to a small another thing that I like about this waist trainer is that it doesn't have any wires here besides the ones inside <laughs> And the fact that it has a zipper, not the little hook thingy, is amazing. Like, it's just a zip. You zip down and then you close it, you know? That makes it so much easier to put on. Like, all the other fitness belt or waist strainers or whatever that I used to wear have, like, those little hooks. And it was just so difficult, like, it was so difficult. So this is another tick for Jay's belt. Like, I love this belt. But what got me confused was how other people, like, all the other YouTubers with, like, you know, 100 and something or 1 point something mil subscribers or whatever are getting, like, theirs in, like, you know, better packages and stuff i'm like okay is it because they're sponsored or what like i i i don't know you know because i expected to get mine like that too like if you're gonna hype something like that we should all kind of get it equally as well you know because this is your product and we are all gonna buy it and we if we're not satisfied with it like it's quiet <laughs> but anyways yes so within three weeks it was here and I was just really happy that I got my second one because the first one was a little too big and stuff and then I wear it like I wear my waist trainer I used to wear the first one I was wearing it like every day Monday to Friday because that's when I used to train I would wear it to work and then come train with it come home then I would wear I would wash it on um, on Friday night so when I wash mine, I just put it, I place it in the washing machine, sprinkle some soap in there, and then just wash. And to dry it, I just hang it outside and let it air dry. Don't put it in, do not put it in the dryer. Leave it outside to dry. I was wearing, I was wearing mine for like more than eight hours because I like wearing waist trainers and I was just passionate about losing inches. And I was doing a lot of intensive workout as well, which I'll include at the end of this video. Um, 
this sweat belt is really good like it's really good for workouts it's really good for um, casual stuff like I would I wear it under my clothes when I'm going out because it's just it's not that visible and it makes you just look that Kim K look to you you know so that's another pro like there's a lot of pros here and how it covers the entire midsection is another plus like when I first had the bigger one because I'm I'm short so it was too long for me I think that's why it was past like um would pass my hips which made it really uncomfortable but the reason why I had to get that size, it was a size medium, the reason why I had to get it was because I was big in the stomach area, like I had a lot of fat there, so I couldn't get like a smaller one, because if I had got a smaller one, it wouldn't have fit, so that's why I got the bigger one, but it was too long for me, so I was like working out so hard, I couldn't wait to lose more weight, so I can get into the size that is my actual size, which is the which is the small one oh, I'm wearing it so when I finally got this one and then I tried it and it sit perfectly where it's supposed to sit it's like up here and down here and I was just like oh my god and you can literally do any workouts in this um, fitness belt you can do anything and for those of you that's been asking me that if you can get this belt and like should you get this belt if you don't do any sort of physical activities? Um, no, because this is meant to enhance your um, your workout. So if you're out here exercising and stuff, this this is the right belt to get, you know, because you, you, you're exercising, you're keeping fit, you're doing some work, you know. But if you just want to get the belt and just wear it at home and not do any sort of physical activities whatsoever, you're not going to lose anything. Like there's no point of you getting this belt if you're not physically active. No point. Because this is not some magic wand. It's not just going to fat disappear. No, it won't do that. This needs you to do, do things. It needs you to exercise. It needs you to work out. It doesn't matter if it's at the gym or at home. You just have to be doing some sort of physical workouts. But if you're not, don't get it. So, so when you order this belt on the JSculpt website, there's like this little section where you enter like um, your waist measurements and your hips and stuff. So make, sh make sure you actually really do measure yourself properly because if you don't measure yourself right, you're going to get the wrong size and we don't want that. So make sure you get the tape and you do measure yourself properly, you know, and go with the sizes that, um, always go with a size, a size bigger. Always get a size bigger than, than you because you just never know. Like, these, um, this fitness belt is not stretchy. Like, it's actually not stretchy. So if you get it too small, you won't be able to like squeeze in it it's not gonna fit you know so it's rather getting getting it a little bit bigger at least you have the velcro belt to make it tighter on there you know and then when you order it the second time you'll know like the right size to get and stuff you know but don't go with the sizes of like or like your bra size or your t-shirt size or the size of other waist trainers that you wear or whatever you know because every, every waist trainer is different and every fitness belt is different so always follow the instructions that are on the website and measure yourself like that's what I did I measure my waist and my hips and I was a size medium or whatever and that's what they sent me and I was only that size for literally like three weeks after three weeks, I was smaller, like, I couldn't fit in this because I lost a lot of inches. So I went down to a smaller size. Okay, you guys, I hope you enjoyed that short review of mine. Um, yeah, I'll include the link down below. So if any of you guys want to go get yourself a pair, you can't. 
And as always, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you guys in my next video.